Evet. Bir daha yapalım. Kızım say. I will be looking at this one. Once you get to know the boards and that lot, you're going to start looking at these cuts the same way. Like, you've got your important one there, but also getting the curve around the ball line. If you've got this in the way, so, you, you know, you're going to be restricted in certain ways. So I'm automatically looking at it, well, I'm going to use the olive board to get that one. But to get this curve, I'm going to want to come from down here. So I'll show you. I've just set the cut up. Freeze up my uh, smaller template, standard one. Now you could try and get as many marks as you could with the uh, pipe finder there, but in these cases it's better to just, you know, use your knowledge as you can with the boards to use. You know what I mean? A combination of what's there. So check me, the only other way you're getting this cut, in all honesty, is getting your template paper out, making a template, and uh, you know, it, it's so purpose, but it's not, it doesn't need to guarantee the same results, you know? Uh, I'm going to put a bit of tape on it, so, because my eyesight shit. Obviously, and the curve is, you know, achievable with radius and that lot. So, this is where your border buddy comes into handy. But I have done videos of how to make the template with dividers and that lot. It's just the same process, it's just that the border buddies all come preset for uh, the eight double ball nose and a single quarter, which is over there. So, anyway. Finder, just square. Because you've got the border buddy, you've only really got a make a few marks, but it, it does run off a bit here, so I want to. Put some extra ones in, it never hurts. That's going to tell me where the other one is. <laughs>